Hello, um, this is weird. Okay, so, what am I doing here? I decided that I couldn't pump out animations every Sunday, but I really want to keep up my upload schedule because it's been really helping my productivity. What I'm doing now is speed paints, but I personally don't like just speed paints with music over them because I think they're boring. So um, I'm going to make narrated speed paints because I very, very much like watching that on YouTube. It's like my favorite kind of video format. So yeah, we're gonna do that. Little disclaimers, sorry for the bad sound quality. I'm literally recording this on my iPad. I don't have a mic or a recording booth or anything. I'm very unprofessional here, okay? Secondly, English is not my first language. It's a language I had to learn in school. So excuse me if I make any grammar mistakes or anything like that, because pff, I, I don't do those because I'm stupid or anything. No, 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 that's just because it's not my first language, right? Yeah, let's just blame it on that. So for this first speed paint, I decided to make our C's in Halloween costumes for spooky season. Yay! This one is Hazel, which is not my OC actually, it's an OC by my friend M, and Hazel is part of the main trio. For this one, I talked to M what Hazel would wear, and she told me about the shark costume, which I thought was the cutest idea. So this is of course the fastest speed paint, because it's really just a shark costume, and I didn't have to design anything myself. Next up is my main OC, Gareth. So, yes. She belongs to me. I thought about a lot of different versions for this design. Um, I thought I could make her a zombie. And I think I thought about making her like a cool vampire, like a Victorian vampire or something, yeah. But in the end, I settled on Ghost. I don't think that came across too much in the design, but I don't know, I'm happy with it anyways. So basically, all of these designs are in canon because, well, two thirds of the trio wouldn't actually go trick or treating. Hazel, yeah, she wouldn't go. She, I mean, if her husband would convince her, then she'd happily dress up, I think, but normally she wouldn't go out of free will. Then, Gareth. Yeah, she would absolutely not go. Like, I think she goes to Halloween parties and shit, but she's probably not dressed up there. But I thought, hell, what if she had to dress up or something? And Dove? Dove actually goes trick-or-treating on Halloween, so that was a bit easier to do, but she comes later. Now, for Gareth, I think she would just... You know, she would like show up in that costume to a party or something and be like oh this old thing yeah i hate it i hate halloween i hate this shit let me go home but in secret she'd be really really proud of it and she'd love it like you know she like someone would tell her there's a halloween party and she would be so happy but she wouldn't tell anyone about it so she searched up like all of those fabrics and stuff and started buying them by the way this was when she was still rich i mean i know that anyone on youtube doesn't know shit about their backstory but i'm just gonna act like you do because come on only my friends are gonna watch this so whatever uh yeah so <laughs> this was when she was rich and could afford costumes like that and i think the vibe is kind of like Victorian ghost in an original design. She also had like a lantern But I kind of forgot about that and then I couldn't incorporate it in the pose Also as you could see right there on the screen I wanted to give her earrings first, but then in the end it didn't work out So don't get used to those. I mean, they're not on screen anyway, so whatever and what I actually did for this thing was that I made Pinterest boards for all the costumes, which was very, very helpful, can recommend. So, yeah, this is Gareth, she's a ghost and she has like, ghost things on her eyes. I don't know what that is, I didn't really flesh it out too much, but uh, yeah, that's that. 
now for the last one. This one is Dove by my other friend A. So actually I talked about this design a lot to A and I really bothered her, like I sent her a thousand pins on Pinterest with different designs of things and yeah I generally just really annoyed her with that so um sorry not sorry. In the end she told me that she wanted Dove to have a witch design but more like a not a normal witch costume that you buy in the store but uh, still kind of homemade like she wanted to have normal casual clothes so for this one i tried to give Dove a way more dynamic pose than the others because she's more excited than everyone else about this uh so yeah she has this like anime girl pose <laughs> I don't know, I thought it fit. And I also gave her a little jack o' lantern um, bag to collect sweets because she's actually the one who goes trick or treating. The others wouldn't go trick or treating, as I said. And A told me to give her like one of those glowy wands you'd get at an amusement park or something <laughs> which are like really cheap and break instantly i had one too and since i couldn't find any stars on pinterest i just took this butterfly thing because i thought it was really really cute yeah <laughs> i don't know i also gave her like little beads on her witch hat like it's a bit customized and I don't know if I can find a picture of this, but you can also get those at amusement parks. And A has told us multiple times that Dove has a lot of those and just likes collecting them. And they're like little bracelets of sugar shit. I don't know what it is, but it's cute, so I put it on her head. So yeah, that's it. I hope you enjoyed. I know the video is a bit shit, but I really hurry to make this. I, I literally make this in a day and I promise it's gonna get better. I just wanted to get this out on Sunday. So yeah, thanks for watching and bye.